I am thrilled. <laughs> I am so excited. I've been waiting for this. This is like one of my favorite sporting events in the whole world. This is my favorite, so this is it. ASU women's soccer has been anxiously waiting for the 2015 Women's World Cup. I'm so excited. Every time there's a Women's World Cup, I get so happy and excited to see women playing at such a high level. And every year, it's so cool because you never realize, like, who's a women's soccer fan. The Sun Devils got their own taste of international action last month when, thanks in part to the Sontag family, the team experienced Spain. It was incredible. It's obviously a once in a lifetime for them to go with uh, all their best friends, basically, the team that they're on, and, and get to celebrate not only the culture of Spain, but also, you know, enjoying playing some soccer against some really good teams. We played four different games. Uh, we trained three times, so seven experiences that way. We went to a, a full men's pro game, which was great as well. Um, and then we went to six different cities. I seriously have the time of my life um, it was definitely a little bit of a not not a cultural shock but I had never been out of the country before so I didn't think I didn't know what to expect but I had such an amazing time going outside of my comfort zone learning a lot about um, the culture uh, the food meeting the people trying to speak um, Spanish it was it was awesome last season the Devils advanced to the second round of the NCAA postseason Going up against top-level teams in Europe will only make them better in Pac-12 play next season. When we went over, we assumed that they would obviously be good, but when we played the first team, I don't think anyone was really ready for how good they were technically. Like, they were cheeky. They, I never knew which way they were going. I thought I did, but it was never the right way. And after a while, we got the hang of it. The passion for soccer that these young women share can be directly linked back to the success of the 1999 U.S. Women's World Cup victory. I grew up uh, in the Mia Hamm, Brandy Chastain era, so that was great for me. And um, one of my good friends actually lived next door to Brandy, so she got to come out to our games and stuff. So she's a huge idol for me. With the World Cup in Canada this year, the Devils are thankful they don't have to set their alarm clocks to watch games in the middle of the night. Gail Jansen, Fox 10 Sports.